Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Chisum Obiwuru and today's video is just like a chilled out video. I promise it's not going to be a very long one. I want to just talk to people on how every one of us watching this video can be more calm during interviews. So trying to reduce any form of stress sore or anxiety to keep it at a minimum and of course excel so be it that is an interview or it's more of like a business presentation so if you know that you're concerned about things as this then i hope you stay to the end so for the purpose of this video i want to take it from actually three dimensions so first would be from the spiritual aspect secondly would be for your physical outlook and third would be for mental but i like to start first with the mental aspect or rather spiritual aspect because i believe there's a god in heaven and if truly you communicate with god all the time or most of the time he's going to guide you through on how to go about things yeah second part will be the physical aspect yes you're going for an interview or you're going to talk about something that's very important to you you have to show up like guys you have to really show up and represent yourself also the part of the mental aspect you have to be prepared if you know truly that you have a goal to attain you have to come prepared so quickly let's go straight to the mental aspect of interviewing yeah. so guys my first tip would be that to always commit into the hands of god so meaning that you have an interview at hand we have a project that you're working on that you need to pitch you have to put it in the hands of god and say god i invite you i welcome you to come help me achieve this so guys that's like the first point you have to consider if you know truly that you don't want to be anxious or you don't want to feel scared during that period of your interview or perhaps you have a business presentation come into the hands of god and trust me you will not be dismayed god will come true for you and show you truly that he's the god of all strength and he blesses whom he chooses to bless so guys, my next idea is to prepare your mind to succeed right majority of what happens in life it starts from here so when you prepare your mind to succeed and of course stop every form of anxiety if perhaps you are preparing and you feel like oh am i going to get this or is it possible am i going to win or not am i going to get this contract you have to keep all those um bad thoughts at bay and prepare your mind and say things like i'm going to get this this suits me I am competent enough to get this job, I'm competent enough to perform at this job, or trust me, I've done this for a long period of time, and I know I'm going to be very capable, I can handle this, or for example, I've gotten the contract. It's not too difficult to say. Guys, let's begin to think about faith, knowing that it's the condition of things, not seen as if that they are, believing that you have gotten this, meanwhile, it hasn't come, but here you're like no 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 chiso say to yourself call your name like call your name in the comment section and say oh no 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 i've gotten this i've gotten this job and even if it still doesn't happen it's not the end of the, your, your life it's not the end of the world you have a beautiful life ahead of you you are going to have a successful career you're going to win more business projects win more business contracts but first you always have to get it right and put at the back of your mind that you can do it so guys now to the physical aspects I am going to say this that recruiters look out for people that dress for the position so for example you are going to be employed as let's say a receptionist or a front desk assistant and you're looking all I don't know like out of place you're not looking like put together for the position before like once you get into the office or the environment that you're going to start the interview or something they'll be like does she know what she's coming here for? Does she know what she's coming here to do? So you need to dress to suit the particular position that you're applying for. If, for example, you are being invited for an interview, for a tech interview, and supposedly tech people are not like people that really dress corporate and stuff like that. They're mostly on t-shirts or very simple clothing. That's a different ball game. But if you know that you're going to be like out there, like more of representative for the company you have to really be on top of a game guys i know it's challenging sometimes to make a decision but you can check on youtube and see other people that talk about styling for corporate people oh yes if you would like me to do a video on styling i would like to know in the comments so please let me know although i'm more of like a simple person like basically i just wear 
something simple but it has to suit like it has to be very suiting to the current place i'm going to so that's it for it so guys make sure to dress minimally see something very simple that won't be all over the place if for example if it was a phone interview now tell me everything is right all around the place you're not really representing yourself so it's very important to reduce anxiety or lack of confidence just dress minimally minimally suiting the position that you are applying for trust me guys that will help a lot to help you be more confident and help you be more focused on the task for example you're hearing a bit of crazy background noise sorry about that to get better so my next point on physical appearance is to appear early perhaps that's not the right word to use but guys try as possible to come early to the place of your interview or the place you're about to sign a contract or have a discussion is very important it keeps you at ease at peace not when you're it's almost like 10 to 15 minutes late you're still scuffling to come to the place and you're all over the place your bag you like you're not a bit orderly and that will make you anxious guys that will really make you very anxious i know for example there's a time that i was invited for um an interview at a tech company I went there almost like 30 or 45 minutes before the main time and voila i was allowed to write even earlier it was like a written interview wasn't it not written assessment so i was allowed to do mine before other people so that was like i felt very good because i already had plans for the day so going there early gave me ample time to start what i needed to do and then i went back home home early even before other people so guys our advice to reduce any form of anxiety try as much as possible to research the location of the company try to know how long it's going to take you 20 minutes or 30 minutes and if you're in lagos ah jesus if you're in lagos you guys know already i also advise if you want to really look very very like very very pink please take an uber or take a boat like make sure you try to, even if you don't have enough funds no excuses guys you have to look paying whatever company you're looking you're going to a small company a medium-sized company a proper corporate company a multinational whatever it is you always have to pre represent yourself okay and if you don't have enough money to because not everyone can afford them but guys let's be let's be practical look at my hands they're of all of different heights yeah if you can't if you can take public transport put your shoes properly in your bag if possible if you're going to wear a suit guys i don't know i don't know what that advice to do i don't know but just 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 good just go to your place of um interview and if you know that what you're going to wear wouldn't look good when you get to the place take it in a bag and wear something simple or something that you can actually wear your right clothes on it i don't know how to put it but all i can say find a way guys to look very presentable before your interview i hope i hope i hope i'm making sense to, to a reasonable extent yes. yeah so my third point on the physical aspect or dimension is to research if you don't do your research when you get to the company and for example your interview you will stutter you will look foolish to the interviewer and you will say rubbish and that's not what you want for yourself you don't want any panic attack you don't want to look stupid you don't want to lose out on that chance of meeting with an interviewer for that your desired job so do it right during your free time i know there are lots of excuses and exceptions that you feel like oh no no i've been interviewed for a long time this shouldn't be a problem but every company is unique and you always have to do a bit of research to know what they do their revenue um, just have a fair idea of what they are into and how you can contribute for example if it's in like a fintech company how do you think you can increase or improve on their functions functions you might not really know about it but perhaps you have a fair overview of what like their design interface is and how you can contribute Phew. wow that's a lot so guys i hope this few points of mine have given you like a best eye view of perhaps how to be less anxious during interviews oh yeah, yeah i forgot to, i forgot to mention this you have to be confident confident i was listening to one time to priyanka chopra and she was talking about how as women 
okay it's, it's women month okay let's say as everyone you have to be confident be it male be it female you always have to be confident that's the highest clothing you can wear i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you very much for staying till this time i would like to read your comments and other topics so let me know i'm willing to share bye bye